So hopefully you can hear me. Um, I don't have my AirPods because I think they have completely died on me. But um, I just wanted to do a video because I was sitting today and I just felt like the Lord was like bringing up something that I hadn't paid attention to. Um, and so basically right now things are just kind of sucky. Um, and I feel like, um, like it's just, you know, like there's just this kind of testing of my faith and that the Lord is like, Brittany, do you trust me? Basically, I didn't feel like praying and studying my word. Um, I think what I felt like I could do is just go sit in my prayer spot and just, and just be there and tell the Lord that I was there and just listen to worship music, um, and and try to say out a prayer if I could but really it was just about getting to the space like getting to the presence of the Lord instead of avoiding you know doing that and so um yeah as I just like listen to songs somebody in my community was like texting me and right, I'm not usually responding to text messages or answering phone calls typically um, but somebody in my community was texting and just like sharing what they were going through. Um, somebody else was talking to me about what they were going through yesterday. And I feel like the Lord was just bringing to mind the words diverse temptations. And so I was like, okay, let me go look that up. I know it's in James. And so the scripture says uh, in James 1, 2, and 3, my brethren count it all joy when you fall into diverse temptations knowing this, that the trying of your faith worketh patience. And so I think that um, depending on the version that we read, sometimes it reads diverse temptations. And I think the other version talks about like trying of your faith. And so I think when we hear temptations, we think enticement to sin. or But then when we think trials, we think maybe like, uh, like approving of our faith or devotion or love to the Lord, or maybe we think like trial through adversity. Um, but I think what the Lord is bringing up to me is like, yes, it, we know that those things, um, at the trying of our faith, like works patience and patience means like, like in the Greek, it, it just kind of means like, um, like perseverance or enduring enduring endurance building endurance kind of thing or patient endurance um but I don't think that that's what the Lord was drawing my attention to I think he was drawing my attention to how the passage is written to a group of people when it says like my brethren or maybe it says my bro brothers and sisters um and how everyone in the community is like going through something so people in the community are going through something there's all these different types of trials and temptations in the community um, and I think that when I was listening to the person that was texting me, my temptation was to look at the other side and be empathetic towards the person that's offending them or the thing that's hurting them, um, rather than sitting like with the, with the person that is like hurt by it and struggling through it. Um, and so it reminds me of my pastor teaching on, um, like the church being the church. And how sometimes people can go to church and not even feel like they're a part of a community, not feeling like people understand, not, pe not feeling like people are walking through things with them. Um, and so I just think that the Lord is like still putting that on me. Like, are you a good friend? Like, do you just sit with people? Do you like, are you empathetic? You know, can you be there without saying, oh, God is just testing your faith? Can you listen and be there for the other person or other people? without saying God is just trying your faith or without blaming them or um, without minimizing the situation. So hopefully this is encouraging.